Hey everyone, I'm Nick de la Torre with Awaken Catholic and welcome to Awaken the Word. Today we're reading from the Gospel according to Luke. Then he looked up at his disciples and said, Blessed are you who are poor, for yours is the kingdom of God. Blessed are you who are hungry now, for you will be filled. Blessed are you who weep now, for you will laugh. Blessed are you when people hate you, and when they exclude you, revile you, and defame you on account of the Son of Man. Rejoice in that day and leap for joy, for surely your reward is great in heaven, for that is what their ancestors did to the prophets. But woe to you who are rich, for you have received your consolation. Woe to you who are full now, for you will be hungry. Woe to you who are laughing now, for you will mourn and weep. Woe to you when all speak well of you, for that is what their ancestors did to the false prophets. We live pretty well today. We live very well today, especially in a historical context. If you look at all of human history, the way that most humans that have ever existed, the way that most of them lived, without indoor plumbing, without electricity, without toilet paper, without eyeglasses, without contact lenses, without laser eye surgery. Okay, am I a little fixated on the vision thing? Yes, I happen to have very bad vision and it irks me to imagine that I could have been born at a different time and not had the benefit of wearing contact lenses. My goodness, what a disaster that would have been. But as you can see, what I'm illustrating here is that we live so well. And because we live so well, we so easily forget that we need to depend on God. And not only should we depend on God, we depend on God whether we realize it or not, our very existence, the fact that we exist day to day is because God keeps us. He holds us in existence by his mere thought. By thinking of us and loving us, he holds us in existence. And not only does he hold us in existence, but everything that it takes for us to survive, our food, our shelter, all of it is a blessing from him. And because we do such a good job, thanks to the industrial revolution, thanks to technology, thanks to science, because we do such a good job of providing for ourselves, we so readily forget he is the one that provides for us. He cares for us. Anything that we have is from him, is a gift from him. And when we lose sight of this, when we lose sight of our dependency on God, we become the gods. My invitation to you is to not allow yourself to lose sight of God as your provider and God as the source of your sustenance. He is God, we are not, and he is much better at being God than we could ever be. I have been Nick. This has been Awaken the Word, and before you go, I just need you to know that Jesus loves you. Peace. Thank you for tuning in to Awaken the Word. Awaken the Word is made in partnership by Spoke Street Media and Awaken Catholic.